Loves. It is Tuesday, October 15th, and I am here in this lovely cabin in Field, British Columbia, BC. I wanted to say that I was in Alberta, but I'm not, I'm not in Alberta. I'm in British Columbia. I did not film yesterday as much because I had just flown in, was really, really tired. It was quite a drive, like a two and a half hour drive to get up here. But you guys saw some of the footage from earlier today, just kind of bopped around to all of the different sites, went to Lake Louise, Emerald Lake, the natural bridge and then tomorrow i am meeting up with sammy and we're actually going to explore banff because apparently there is a really according to sammy it is a very very magical town and i haven't been there yet so i'm really looking forward to that it is almost 7 p.m at night so i spent a lot of the day just driving around to all of those different sites and now that it's getting later and the sun's going down i wanted to go ahead and get some writing in since that was a lot of the reason I wanted to book a cabin that was kind of secluded and out into the woods. Sorry, I keep looking out the window because it looks like it's snowing, but it's actually just the fire from the chimneys from the cabins next door. But anyways, um, I wanted to book this cabin specifically because I wanted all those fantasy writing vibes for NaNoWriMo. So I'm gonna get some words down and yeah, we'll just see how it goes. <laughs> about six o'clock in the evening. No, later than that, 6.40 in the evening. I just got back to field to my little cabin up here and in the nick of time too, because it's supposed to snow tonight, tomorrow and Friday. So yeah, probably good that I got here before it started flurrying and snowing. But I just got back from a wonderful day in Banff with Sammy. It was so much fun. We took the gondola ride up the mountain, as you guys saw, and got to see just all the views from the top of the mountain. And then we also went to, I'm forgetting the name of it, the Fairmont. It's like a castle hotel, which was like super vibey. I feel like I have so much inspiration to write a scene for Sirlia Jareth, Queen Sirlia Jareth. So I might be doing that this evening. But I wanted to give a shout out to Sammy. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to hang out with me. It was so much fun. And she also got me the cutest socks, which I'm not wearing, but I will show them later on. This adorable Banff coffee mug, which I will definitely be drinking out of constantly <laughs> when I'm back home in Texas, wishing that I was here. Oh yeah, it has been a full couple of days so far. I'm not gonna lie, I am pretty tired. So I'm probably just gonna be relaxing for most of the evening. I'll keep the windows open not open but like the blinds open so I can see if the snow is actually falling or not and I'll probably go upstairs to my little desk and get some writing in and yeah just have like a quiet a quiet evening at the cabin and we shall see what tomorrow holds I have one more day here and then Friday I head back to Texas <music> Oh, 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 
to Canada. And yes, I am holding a wand that I got from Harry Potter World because essentially I realized I am dressed like Luna Lovegood today. So as you could probably tell from the vlog, I didn't get as much footage as I would have liked to, but while I was there, I realized that I really just wanted to be more in the moment and not behind a camera screen. So my apologies for not getting as much footage, but it was a trip that was much needed more for my, just the clearing of energy and my brain and creativity, just kind of like reigniting that spark. So I hope that you enjoyed the vlog nonetheless. And a couple of things before I sign off here. So I had a lot of people who recently found my channel who reached out to me saying that they missed like by a day that YouTube kind of failed them, <laughs> that they missed by a day the sale for the right 50K in 30 days course. So I'm going to go ahead and reopen or extend that coupon code until the end of October, October 31st, which is Halloween. So we're gonna call it a Halloween sale where you can get 50% off that right 50K in 30 days course. So originally it is valued at $200, but you can get it with the code writer 1019 for just $97. It is wonderful if you are planning on participating in NaNoWriMo this year and you're really motivated to get 50,000 words of your first draft down on paper. This course is what I have used for the past four years. I have written first drafts of eight books in those four years. So yeah, I have a method and it works. And I knew that it would be a disservice to not share that methodology with fellow writers like yourselves. On a similar note, for all of you aspiring creative entrepreneurs out there, my signature business program called Elevate is open for enrollment for the last time this year, but only for two more weeks. So that enrollment period closes on Monday, November 4th. If you're ready to finally live the life that you have always dreamed, create an online business that brings in passive income, you're able to do what you love doing, like your passions, every single day for work, my life and what I've been doing is a great example of that, then this program is definitely for you. Payment plans are available. Again, this enrollment period will close. It's the last one for this year on Monday, November 4th. You can find the links for both that course, Write 50K in 30 Days, and the Elevate program in the description box below. And make sure you stay tuned for next week's video because I will be sharing some exciting announcements about something that I have been talking about a lot on Instagram lately. So if you're not following me, make sure you do that. But yes, exciting announcements about that event that I, that I had alluded to that many of you took a survey about. There will be more information, magical here, more information on that in next week's video. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you more than you know, and I will see you in next week's video. Bye.